Yo, what is poppin' YouTube? It is your boy B here, bringing you guys another video today, man. I am excited to kind of just give you guys my impressions and my review of the Battlefield 2042 beta and kind of let you guys know how this game is gonna, you know, pretty much feel in the full game. Um, am I actually gonna be playing the full game? Am I not? I'll let you guys know here in a sec. Before I go ahead and drop this uh, review here, please go ahead, hit that like button, hit that sub button, and definitely comment down below. If you guys play the Battlefield 2042 beta, let me know in the comment section and then let me know how you guys enjoyed it, man. I um, am bringing you guys my review right about now, so let's get straight into it. So, the Battlefield 2042 beta, man. Um, we only got to play one map, unfortunately. Uh, I wish we could have played another map. It was a, uh, just, I believe this was a conquest. Um, this wasn't uh, any of like the war maps or anything like that. Um, this was just regular conquest. So it's basically just domination, just on a large field scale um, for Battlefield, for those of you who've never played Battlefield before. Um, it was very fun though. The map was very good. The map is very fun. I really liked the map. The map was amazing. Um, the graphics are just crazy uh, in this game. This, this everything was good. I, I believe I'm running this right now on like low graphics. So you guys can see here um, just how good it looks just on low graphics, you know? Um, so can you imagine just playing this on ultra? You know, especially if you have like a 240 hertz monitor. I only have a 165 hertz. So uh, that's what I'm playing on. But could you imagine this like 240 hertz ultra? You know, like that, that would be crazy. Um, but this game is very, very beautiful. The sun is not too bright when you look at it. Call of Duty, please fix that. Um, it's very good, man. Uh, gameplay is nice. You know, I always love the vehicles in the game, the tanks, the jets, the helicopters. There's even this transport helicopter that's just absolutely huge, man, and it's crazy. And it moves very slow, obviously, because it's a transport helicopter. It's just meant to um, transport a shit ton of your teammates to a certain area. But... You know, it's it's very fun, man. Um, I have absolutely zero problems with this game. And I have absolutely just zero, um, zero complaints for the most part. Uh, other than the jet gameplay was a little bit laggy, or just the vehicle gameplay in general was just super, super laggy. Um, like I was, uh, if you guys look at my clip on TikTok, I have a clip up there and I'm trying to fight this jet and this jet's just super laggy and it's just super crazy and I couldn't hit the jet um until like i i locked onto it with my my rocket finally and i was able to shoot him down but that's the only complaint man um i didn't get any lag in this game while i was playing i didn't get any you know bad frame rate drops i didn't get any disconnections uh there was a lot of players in the lobby the lobbies were pretty full um everything was nice there was no cheaters or hackers that i ran into nothing out of the ordinary that would have made me just say oh the, we're, this game is screwed you know um but everything was everything was good um, in terms of like the characters, the attachments on the weapons, the weapon gameplay. Everything was very very nice. It was sweet. Um, I love how the characters work in this game this year. So say if you want to play as a medic, but you don't want to use like a medic crate, you want to instead use like a armor um, armor plate. As you guys can see here, I'm playing as the assault, um, but I'm not use I'm not necessarily using assault uh, assault packages. You see my throwables, a, um, a sensor grenade, which basically shows uh, some enemies near me on the map. And then I'm using, uh, I, I just switched to the sniper package with the C4, but you can see here, I'm still actually using um, an assault rifle. I don't have to use a sniper rifle, which is nice. So if you wanna play somebody who wants to run around with an AR, but you know you want that C4, but the C4 would only come on the, um, the sniper rifle package, you can now basically change that so you could you could run whatever you want basically which is nice um uh they have like a whole bunch of different things they got like c4 armor plates you know uh rocket launcher of course grappling hook which is just so dope for the assault so the assault has the grappling hook um you've, you've seen some gameplay here you've just seen me calling a dog right there um i named her cleo that is my robot dog's name and uh it's just very nice man the the gameplay everything's good you know um like another thing too, the vehicle gameplay was, you know, I, like I said, it was a little bit laggy, but I'm trying to fly jets. It's hard for a little newbie like me who's never flew jets before, but it's it's extremely fun. Um, a lot of people like to hate on Battlefield because it's not as fast paced as Call of Duty because the maps are bigger and that's okay. You know, everybody's entitled to their own opinions. You know, you can't be mad at them for that. But I encourage everybody to just please give Battlefield 2042 a try. If you buy it on Steam, you get up to two hours of gameplay before you um, can get a refund. So if you go over that two hours of gameplay, you can't get a refund. But if you haven't gone over that two hours of gameplay, you can still get a refund, man. So go ahead, just buy it, try it out, and just you know see how you like it. 
you know, you don't always have to play Call of Duty every year. You know, as we've seen, you know, with War, you know, Warzone, you know, the Call of Duty doesn't necessarily run their games 100% correct every year. Um, neither does Battlefield. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm not shitting on either game like that. I'm not, I'm trying to be you know as fair as possible, but I'm just saying, you know, give Battlefield a try, man. Um, it's a very very fun game. Uh, like I said, graphics are nice. Gameplay is very great. Gunplay is great. Um, vehicle play is great. Other than that little bit of lag we had, but everything is great, man. There's there's not too many complaints um, with this game. You guys will enjoy it if you do play it, especially if you have a squad of four. You really will enjoy it just a lot. Um, I had so much fun playing this, man. The full game is going to be amazing. Uh, I could already tell. I'm probably not going to play the campaign. Um, I might or might not. I don't know. Sometimes I like to play the campaigns in Battlefield just because they are kind of cool. But other than that, um, mainly going to be hopping on the multiplayer for sure. Uh, I was playing this on mouse and keyboard, but you can always go ahead and play this on controller. Um, one thing I did forget to mention, as you guys could see on my screen, there's a little thing right there um, for my, my keybind for T. And uh, basically, it allows you to switch your attachments on the spot. I don't know if I got any gameplay of me doing that here. Um, but you could literally switch your attachment on the spot, which is just so cool. You don't have to wait until you die. You could just switch them real quick for depending on what you need. Um, so if you needed to be fighting a little bit more close quarters, then you could go ahead and put some attachments on for close quarters or if you need to go ahead and fight longer range you can do that also um it allows you to just do it on the fly which is nice you don't have to wait man which is just beautiful and it it, it makes the gameplay a lot better you know um it, it fastens up the gameplay it doesn't slow it down uh being able to do that having to wait until you get into the main menu and you know switch your attachments like i say you can do it on the fly and it's just so 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 cool I wish Call of Duty had something like that, but you know, they make you wait until you die. But um, I personally like this, it, it's great. Um, you guys see me here just, you know, going crazy with the grappling hook. I love the grappling hook, man. It's such a cool thing. Um, it's amazing, but that's pretty much just my review. Uh, you know, it's just a beta, so it's not like it's the full game. So I can't really go through and give you guys the f like full full review, like a full breakdown. Um, we're here, uh, it's about like maybe about like a seven minute review of just me actually talking about the game um just because like i said it's a beta but once the full game comes out we will have like a part two review on this um and just kind of like more insights and more of my thoughts on battlefield once the, you know the full game comes out so we'll wait for that and then i'll give you guys another video on that um i'm gonna go ahead and just let the rest of this gameplay ride it's about a 13 minute gameplay in total um as i said you guys you know just uh just enjoy it so let me know what you guys think about the Battlefield beta in the comment section below. Um, if you guys did play it, I will be playing this when, it, when the full game does come out. So if you guys do want to play with me, definitely hit me up, man. And I uh, definitely will play with some of you guys. So without further ado, man, this has been Now Boy B. And I hope you guys drop a like on this video. Definitely hit that sub button, man, for more content. Um, I am going to be playing Back for Blood and New World again. Um, Back for Blood just came out today, so I will be on that tonight. A new World just came out, so I will be on that as... Uh, oh, New World's been out, sorry. Um, I will be uploading more videos on that as well. So just wait on that, guys. Um, and yeah. Anyway, man, it's been No Much Boy B, man. I'm going to see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Please. Problem. Read that, I think, now. Somebody's always behind me, man. Dang, bro. I'm making some clean, like, plays, too, dude. What the? Dude, you're lying. Oh, Lord, that's glitchy. He killed me with a C4? He was dead! Help! Come on, chat. Oh, fire! 
don't like how I spawn in here with you, but you seem like you need help, big dog. Ah! Reload! Oh my god! <laughs> I wasn't reloaded, bro. Where we going? Keep over here. Take me over there! Took me on top, took me on top. Oh, that's my teammate. I'm done. I swear I had C4 on him. I'm not crazy. American troops occupying most of the map. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we're going into battle, big dog. Me and you. Me and you. Me and you. Me and you. You're lagging, but me and you. You're lagging. Okay, I need to switch my sensitivity for sure on jets, bro. It's way too slow. I'm gonna die if I do that. Hold on. For you, big dog. You're lagging. Someone needs to teach me how to fly planes, bro, because this shit is difficult. I will tell you that, man. It is difficult to fly planes on mouse and keyboard, bro. I have 30 kills and assists. What'd I do? One of my like stats, stats. Nothing. <laughs> 